Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time here, my name is Lizzie and welcome. So today I have a makeup tutorial for you guys. Um, this is my client Davina and she was actually having her birthday party, which was Nollywood themed. Um, initially, you know, I wanted to go for the full Nollywood effect as in the thin brow, the dark liner, the black or dark lip liner, but you know, <laughs> she said nah, she wanted a normal glam and yeah, but she did allow me to add the black beauty dot by her lips, so I was happy. Also guys, can we just deep that I am actually getting better at this editing thing, I mean, look at this image insert thing that I figured out on myself like I need my accolades <laughs> but anyways guys happy new year everybody so I actually wasn't going to record a voiceover for this video I was just gonna let you guys enjoy it but I think I'm gonna do it anyway just because <laughs> so here I am applying concealer on her eyelid just to mute out her lid a bit and allow that colour to pop. So now I'm just going in with this Beauty Bay eyeshadow palette. Um, I really love this palette for like my transition colours and my nudes. It's really inexpensive as well, so it's really a great palette. Um, I'm just going to be using, I think I used three shades from this palette just for uh, the transition and to add some depth also. prepping her eyelids with this NYX glitter primer um, and that is just going to prepare her lid for this pigment that I'm about to use and yeah I think I got it from eBay it was from a vendor on eBay it came in a set of three I believe and yeah they're really good really pigmented so I'm just going in now with a black eyeshadow just to create like a smoky um, So for her brows, I'm using the MAC Pro Longwear Fluid Line in the shape Dip Down just to go over her brows. I don't really need to do much to her brows because she has them um, microbladed, so it was really easy. You didn't really need much products either. So to clean up her brows just a little bit, I am using this e.l.f. concealer. Thank you. 
foundation, I am using the NARS Soft Matte Foundation. Um, you know, my clients know I love this foundation, it's one of my favourite. And I am using the shade Marquise, I believe that's how it's pronounced. Excuse me if I'm wrong. Now I'm going in with this Maybelline Eraser Concealer. I'm using the shade 11 Tan. And then I'm gonna go in with a much brighter shade and that is from e.l.f. I'm now in a habit of using lipsticks and lip glosses as blushes. So here I'm using a Nigerian brand um, lip palette and just applying that really nice pink shade on her um, cheeks. I didn't use a lot there, just a little bit. translucent powder so I'm really loving this setting powder it's now become my go-to first reach powder and that's just because it goes well with you know almost almost every skin tone so I kind of like just reach for it first
So now I'm using the Juvia's Place Bronzed Duo in the shade Dark. I absolutely love this. I think this was the first time I used it actually since I got it and I absolutely loved it. So there is now a Juvia's Place um, stand in Superdrug. So I picked this up because I've been really wanting to try it and it was really hard to get my hands on it because it wasn't like available in the UK that easily. So I was very happy to finally get to use it and I absolutely loved it. So my camera died while I was doing her lip gloss but yeah so now I'm just tapping in that powder right into her eyes I'm not really dusting it off as much I'm just tapping it in just to get like a, a better coverage my favorite Charlotte Tilbury setting spray and this is the final look guys thank you so much for watching hope you guys enjoy this and thank you so much for watching make sure you subscribe and share comment all of that good stuff and I'll really appreciate it thank you guys and bye for now